with us since they were very small. They were little just like Angada right there is. They've lived with us since they were tiny. With those different wildlife, incredible opportunities to uh, meet them up close. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Of course we have the beautiful Ongara. Look how big he is, he's getting bigger every day, I swear it. Um, so what happened today was um, we drove up from Miami and just because there is a change, um, one of the Gibbons, she's, she's eating well, but I'm worried about her calorie intake. We watch their food intake, we weigh them all the time. Um, so anytime she just goes slightly off, I give her a treat, which is called a perfect bar. And that gives her a, a ton of calories and she absolutely loves it. So what happened is a bunch of the house is flooded here. We have to go down to the house to get the perfect bars for her. So I have Aaliyah with me. Um, I'm not going down there by myself either way. So I figured I would film it for you and let you guys see. Yes, we do live in top tropical paradise and yes, this is one problem we have occasionally. Let's go. So it's too deep already to, uh, ugh. I hope there's no spiders in my boots. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, so it's too deep already to drive down there. So we're gonna have to walk. Um, it's not too deep for Angada to go with me. Like I said earlier, he's with me all the time, so he'll just hang out back there. Let's go. All right, Aaliyah's got her waders on. Wow. Aaliyah, it's gotten deep. Oh, this is kind of scary. Oh, there's even boats here, so I guess it is really I deep. don't know whose boat this is, mm. but wow. So there is a ton of houses down here. Um, so this is, what do you think? This is the fourth time we've had a flood? Fourth flood in the last two and a half years. Okay, so I've lived here for 20 years and there's only been four floods. So something new has happened. Um, I do believe that the government is thinking about it and working on it. So hopefully this will not be a problem that continues, but we still got to get down to that house and get that perfect bar. You ready? Yay, so excited! Um, so I did not realize it was this deep. So we went and got a kayak. Um, we're gonna kayak over there, it's fine. Cause Angada is perfectly happy. As long as I'm perfectly happy, I'm not scared. Um, like I said, this has happened before. So we're gonna get in the kayak. Thank you, Amelia, for the assistance. Okay. Yay. Get in here with me? Yep, I'm just gonna push this out this way. Okay. <sighs> oh god, here we are! We made it! Your heads hurt. <sighs> okay, and we're off. Alright, we're off. Okay, I'm gonna make you paddle. Okay. I gotta hold this okay, guy. Okay, switch. Ding. It's way easier to paddle on the river <laughs> than it is to, when it's home. So that house is underwater. Um, there's a couple of houses that just are a little bit lower than the other ones. Um, this is crazy. Look at the stop sign. And look at those mailboxes Mailbox over gone. there. Yeah, it's a, it's a crazy weird issue that we have. But um, one, once again, like I said, we do live in tropical paradise, so. The animals are always warm. The zoo is high and dry. We're, they're safe, they're happy. Um, it's just some of these houses are getting wet. So we did get a little bit of a warning that this was gonna happen. So of course we had all of the staff and a whole crew that came in to try to help save all of the furniture and just get everything out of the way. But there's always something that gets forgotten and the perfect bars are one of the things that got forgotten. So we're gonna head in there and get a perfect bar for Jack. Look at him, he's having fun. He brings his cool down here, huh? This is kind of crazy, isn't it? Yeah, the whole world is flooded. There's water everywhere. 
What's going on, baby on Nana? All right, let's head inside. So according to the news, it's gonna raise until tomorrow. Currently, whew, it's not in this house yet. Um, but there are a couple staff members that do have it actually in their house. We have been through this before, so the houses are actually set up. So when the floodwaters are gone, you can just like scrub the house and, and go back to um, just living your normal life. But of course, you can't come down here and sleep down here while it's flooded. So actually, um, maybe this was high tide and it's gone back down. So hopefully it's actually on its way down, not up more. <laughs> All right, we've made it to the perfect bars. Um, as you can see, we have the fridge actually up on cinder blocks. The reason for this is last time the fridge was floating because the water was actually above the countertops. So this had just floated away, crazy. Okay. Oh, not tall enough. So as you can see, the electricity is still working. I don't know if you guys... I Nobody paid me to say this. I don't know if you guys have tried it, but this is definitely one of my favorite snacks. I love the perfect bar. So this is crazy, but I have to lock the door, even though we're completely flooded. Um, Last time they actually put um, a police blockade up there and they had multiple police officers there all of the time because people are just ready to take advantage of this type of scenario. They know that the houses are empty. Um, last time I actually watched rescue people coming in with boats and taking people out of here, um, even with dogs. It was crazy um, because people don't want to leave their houses. They don't have anywhere else to go. This is a huge issue, but luckily we do have other places to go. Um, I've had several people move in with me because my house is high and dry too. Thank you. And we got our bars, so let's go home and get it to dry. All right, here we go. Out and about and oh no, it's <laughs> You got this. Hop in. Thank you so much for the help. Ah! Okay, we got this. Oh, we're going in the bushes. Let oh, jeez. Okay. okay. Get us home. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> so, you can see behind us, this is completely outrageous, but we are prepared for it. Um, so, we have been through several hurricanes. We do have safe places for all the animals to go. And in the case of flooding, the preserve has never actually flooded. Nope. Just... Aliyah's home. Yeah, most of the time. <laughs> this is the second time. And a couple Aaliyah. of the other staff's homes. Um, we have our perfect bars. We're gonna go find Jai and go feed her. All right, guys, we're back at the preserve. Um, as you can see, once again, we're high and dry here. And we got the perfect bar for Jai. I just remembered um, it's like four o'clock and I haven't eaten yet. She doesn't eat a whole bar, so I'm gonna eat the other half. You want half? It has really good ingredients. That's why I like it. Um, you can read every single ingredient. It's something that you recognize. Um, nothing scary at all. And she absolutely loves it. Um, everyone has their own personality though. Her boyfriend doesn't like them. So I always get the other half. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as we enjoyed making it. Um, once again, we are safe. We are high and dry. We are having a good time. Thank you so much. If you like this video, like it, comment, subscribe if you haven't already, and remember, stay wild. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Of course, I'm here with the beautiful Angara, and we got a whole bunch of balloons because we're heading to Sugriva's ninth birthday party. The chimps love a party just because there's so much going on. They're so incredibly social. Chimps are a lot like us in that social way, but also they're 98% us, right? <laughs> they grow at the same rate as us. They hit every stage in life at almost the same time. And they can live almost as long. Let's go party. You ready? It's a big party. It's a party. It's a party. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's time for a present show. Yeah, present. yeah. It's time for a present. It's present. It's present. It's present. You like for what? Uh, yes, 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 yes.
Happy birthday to you. Oh, you're trading me. You're trading me your empty piece of cake. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's okay. <laughs> Want strawberry?
Oh, there you go. That's very Tim style. This way you can really see where you're getting into. <laughs> this is why chimpanzees don't do surgery. No. It'll be happy as long as you take your glasses off. You want me to take those off for you? You can't take the earrings. No, those are mine. I'm gonna try. I get it. Those for me. Hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as we enjoyed making it. If you liked it, like it, comment, subscribe if you haven't already, and remember, stay wild. With us since they were very small, they were little, just like Angada right there is. They've lived with us since they were tiny. With those different wildlife, incredible opportunities to uh, meet them up close.